The number of health conditions connected to toxin exposure for service members was expanded with the signing of the PACT Act by President Joe Biden last August. For years, veterans sought care and compensation for illnesses connected to their years of service. Everything from Agent Orange in the Vietnam War to respiratory problems connected to burn pits in Iraq and Afghanistan. Everything is, is being considered, so there's not a, a list that says, no, this isn't going to be considered. Frank Pearson is the CEO and executive director of the VA San Diego Health System. He says VA benefits personnel will be on hand at two summer vet fests in Chula Vista and Oceanside to help veterans find out if they qualify for new PACT Act benefits. And at this point, there are presumptive diagnoses. So if you served in certain areas that are known to have had certain exposures, then you're going to be interviewed and witnessed, and there's going to be a review of, of your information, and then there will be assessment. The Oceanside Vet Fest will be Saturday, July 15th at the Oceanside VA Clinic, followed by another August 5th at the Chula Vista Vet Center. While veterans can submit claims for illnesses identified by the PACT Act at any time, those who submit those claims by August 9th will have any awarded disability benefits backdated to August of 2022. Andrew Dyer, KPBS News.